Hello and welcome to anyone who may be watching this. I'm Friend Loke and I'm gonna be playing some Slay the Spire on the same file as the previous recording was in. And since the silent was unlocked, we're gonna be, we're gonna be playing as her. Yeah, I gonna take this no matter what with those options. Now, no chance of getting an, an elite, but hmm. In case the events have some dangerous, this does give me a rest site before the elite. But these paths just have one lead each, while this one has the potential for two. And this one also has a rest site right before it, so yeah, let's go down here. There we go. Let's take a blur. Blur is nice. Do 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 do. Shivs. Yeah, let's take the money. Damage something that can be healed. So. Yeah, alright. It's like 75 to remove it, so still 100 profit. <sighs> okay. None of these are super... Eh, honestly, Sucker Punch is nice. Alright, now... Blur might be a good choice. Blade Dance is also nice. Sucker Punch does apply too weak, which... Yeah, let's go for that for now. Alright, it's Gremlin Nub. Let's slap some damage on him. Hmm. Let's get some extra damage going. Might have been better to do the soccer... to do the the sucker punch, but, yeah, whatever. Okay. Ah. Blocking just isn't the best idea right here, but if I block if I block 10, I'm taking 4 extra damage from all hits for the rest of the battle, so it's only actually useful if I'm able to end the battle in two turns, which definitely not going to be able to do with those, but yeah. Especially with how I'm going to be doing the weakness, but yeah, let's do it anyways. Oh, right, the weak. Oh, that means he's going to be doing E. Okay. I can reapply the weak at least. Block the damage. Hope I draw some Miracle Hand that can kill. That's not what that is. Next hand should be enough. If it's not, I have a potion. Yeah. Okay. That could have gone... Ooh! That's good. Burst is nice. Let's go in here. Shops are nice. Hmm. Okay, so this is vi weakens elites a lot. This gives a random colorless, semi-random colorless card. This has synergy if I go all blocks for a turn, if I do burst, blade dance, some else that triggers it. While I'm able to do more stuff. This does weaken elites, but this is AoE that is more useful in all combats, so let's do that. And I have the money to remove the curse. Yeah. Oh, sweet. <sighs> Yawning. Okay. Okay. 
Is it next steel? Oh, okay, it's just next this turn, next steel. So, didn't waste it. Well, didn't not make good use of it. So, uh, mm -hmm. thirty-two is where it splits. So maybe let's not use this shiv. Eh, actually, we won't, we won't be doing a ton of extra damage, so let's throw a potion on it just to make it so both little slimes will have 16 health. Who's the boss going to be? Hexaboy. Okay. That's my favorite way of blocking damage. Killing the enemy. If I can get White Beast statue or something that can make good use of the Ornithopter and the potion belt. Okay. Poison or dexterity because power is basically a disaster, so after I use it, it won't be clogging up my draws. Well, I'm. Well, that one better than I expected. Huh. <sighs> okay, like Evelyn. Okay, that is something. So I can build up some block for the tourney awakens. Okay, so he's probably not going to be able to actually do damage to me there. Yeah, definitely not. Kind of wish I managed to get another blur, but yeah, that's just how it is sometimes. Yeah. Do do do. Okay. <sighs> Well, no block. Now he probably won't be doing too much damage, so I'm not gonna. So I'm gonna. Wow, I cannot do words right now. But yeah, letter opener is also a source of damage if he starts getting my strength too low. So yeah, with blur it's honestly better to play three skills than to play a strike because the blur does keep going. Yeah. Ooh! Okay, now I just need three skills, which I'm probably going to draw. Death by Defend. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Sneaky Strike. I don't have a ton of discard. That would give me some discard, but let's grab the Poison Stab, because Poison's nice, and it's just a decent attack. Okay, let's do this to get some AoE on them, and play another another one just so I block it all. Okay. Yeah. Okay, sweet. Gonna blur so I have a bit of block for next turn. Okay, let's do to do. Don't want to be too wasteful, but there we go.
that's the damage blocked. I'm 9 out of 10 towards nunchucks being procced, so. Let's get a bit closer for the boss fight. This is good if I discard it. Yeah, let's grab it, because I do have Survivor. Don't have a ton of discard methods, but, yeah. Okay. Whee! Alright. Let's get some blocks to carry over from turn to turn. And smack down a bit with some weakness. Okay, so that's 18 damage incoming. Yeah, let's get the damage. Okay. Okay, not gonna block it all, sadly, but gonna get some damage off on him. It them. Whee! Okay. Hmm. In the end, I'm not going to get through the block anyways, so... we. Okay, now... Although it would have been... Progress to eh, I did make a mistake there. There we go. Okay, good. Perfect block. Oh, never mind. I forgot about the burn. If I was ironclad, I would have ways to block this, but I am, in fact, not ironclad. Not the best build here, but I don't have all the things I would really need, so... Okay, so getting rid of the burn is better because I don't really have anything to spend the energy on for tactician. Okay. Oh, this is bad. I'm not dead yet. Yeah. Emphasis on yet. No, this is definitely not enough to kill him. And I'm dead.
Let's play my favorite little robot boy. If someone does want me to upload the that silent run, I certainly can, but it's nothing special. Okay, if I get insanely lucky, I can get a one health elite here. And then this can be a three elite path. Okay, I have a plan. Ooh, okay, so if I hit these shops, I will be removing relics from the pool, but that will minimize the chances of getting enemies from the question mark rooms by because I'm pretty sure the chance of an enemy increases the more you hit in a row without a normal enemy fight. So, if I only hit two, then basically only this one is threatening the extra enemy. So, one fight, potentially one more fight. I can go here to dodge this fight and then fight the elite. So, this does give me a high chance of being able to avoid the, well, getting the one health elite, which, yeah, okay. I'm sure whatever I said sounded like absolute nonsense with how I worded it, but watch Frost Prime. <laughs> Ooh, I'd love membership card this early, or Frozen Egg as the defect. Let's grab a defrag. And yes, I do know I brought Dishonor to the claw gang, but yeah. Ooh! Okay, so I can... Well, let's just have fun. Okay. Kind of sucks to miss out on some of those, but yeah, that's just how it is. Let's... Oh. I'm more broke than I thought. Okay, so... Hmm. Yeah, let's go here for the card, since I didn't get any fights from those question rooms. Okay, loop is nice. Hello. Goodbye. Hologram, it's... Yeah, it just doesn't exhaust when you upgrade it, which is nice. Go and grab that for potentially tutoring stuff from a graveyard. <coughs> okay. Now is where we actually have to care about enemy health. Kakaa! Wow, I just lost my voice when I tried to say Kakaa there. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, screw taking damage. Okay, capacitor might be nice. Tempest. If I am going for kind of a lightning thing here, that could be good. Double energy is potentially nice. Dem double energy is nice for X cost cards, which I don't have any yet. It could also be good if I have a hand of big cards. Tempest is good if I get a lot of lightning synergy, but let's go for the... Capacitor does kind of It makes it harder to, to evoke, but it lets you have more passive things going on, which is good if you're going for Frost, I, I think. Let's grab the Tempest. Might be the wrong choice, but it's the choice I made. Ooh, that's a tough choice. Defrag is focused, loop is... So it's basically plus one or double. So, never mind, not a tough choice. Eh, let's not block. Oh, I'm bad at math. Yeah, no idea what kind of math I was doing, but it wasn't the right math. Okay, let's... Blop. Blop. <coughs> I 
<clears throat> yeah, I'm taking some damage here, but yeah. Okay. This does damage and makes lightning, so there we go. Let's... Okay, so this is 13 damage, while this is 18 damage. Let's exhaust that so it doesn't clog up draws. Wahahaha. Okay. I could do clogging or I could get some frost going. Ooh, okay, so this would awaken him. If I draw Defrag, he wakes up in like three turns, I think, so. Let's, if I draw Defrag next turn, I'll play it. If not, I'll start building up to wake him up. Let's... Save this, I guess. Doot, doot. Exhaust this. Do I have anything that'd be a good thing to grab? I could hologram back the cold snap. And block a little bit just so I'm not doing as bad health wise. Bang bang. Aha, you may be draining my strength and decks, but I don't need those. Ooh. Okay, I guess I'll grab another loop. Do the loop de loop and pull. Let's let's see if I do it lucky. That's not luck lucky. Well, this could be an issue. Strike me down. I can take it. Well, on the bright side for him, he is gaining three strength. Okay, not too bummed about losing out on those as defect. Kind of sucks to not get bottled lightning, and Strange Boon is still always useful for everyone. But, yeah. Okay. It's the boys. Might have been better to... Now nah, the, the recruit... Here, let's do this first and see if... Ooh, Frost. Frost will be kind of 
growing in value, so it will kind of pay for itself, I think. If I grab Cold Snap, then that gives me another Frost. I can throw it on him, and then I can zap to evoke and have the Frost be the ones that are being looped. And gonna exhaust this because it's not that good until I get tons of energy stuff going on, or until it's upgraded. At least in this deck. So far. Okay, one down, two to go. This is given some decent passive block, which is nice. In fact, this basically means that I won't be taking damage from them anymore. In fact, if one, I can just sit back and relax now. This is nice. This is nice. Let's go for the kill. Ooh. Not the best thing, but it's just Vialia. Seek is nice. Let's rest to get some health back because we are low. Well, let's loop de loop de loop de loop de loop So I think I'm doing 15 per turn from orb so far. Bump that up a little bit. Oh, okay, so hold on. So if I'm doing Okay, that's definitely not going to bring him down. Yeah, let's use this now and just yeah get that going I don't want to eat the slime crush so I might try and pop him do I have anything zero that no okay so not Wait, actually if I get cold snap that will evoke uh, lightning Let's have it be the first one up, so so we'll start pumping out the block. And 32 health on the medium slimes is not the worst thing. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, whatever. Okay. Let's get the offense going. Okay. This is good. It's it doesn't exhaust, so it can basically... It doubles the effect of all our powers if we get going. Inserter... Huh. If we're going for a lot of focus and trying to stack up tons of frost... Sure. And it also is good with that one card I'm forgetting the name of that sacrifices an orb slot to gain focus. Although that might not be unlocked yet at this... This early. Okay, so this path can only do one, one elite, while this one can do two, and both of them do have rest areas before them. Huh. I... 
could try and minimize damage a little bit, or I can try and kill him more. Jerk, trying to rob me. I don't like being robbed. I like my money. This is hurting a little bit. <laughs> so that's just like one lightning. I'm not sure why it says it's going to be evoking both of those. <laughs> this. <laughs> now let's grab that one extra lightning. And I'm going to be taking 16, which I will need to be healing. But... She's dead. That definitely could have gone better. I'd love to do the stealth repair soon, soon but yeah. None of those are good for this deck, I think. Blizzard was a maybe, but I don't think my frost generation is that big. Should have done this first to get the card draw, but okay, great. Just got a strike out of the way. Okay, now. Let's doot, doot, block a little bit. Do, 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 do. Okay, no, I wouldn't be able to play both of those. If I do this dual cast, then I'm getting some a bit of block that can be used. I'm gonna exhaust the tempest so it's out of the way. Mouse, what's going on with you? Okay, that's a little bit better. Oh, it's dead. As in the end, not my mouse. Just to clarify. <laughs> Gonna be taking some damage, but yeah, I do need to get a self repair or something. Am I dead? I'm totally dead. Huh. Can I do anything that will save me? Compile driver could draw me two cards, but that won't be able to do much. Huh. Well. That went well. Bonk. Bonk. <laughs> nice. I might just put together the two recordings for the two failed runs I just did, so you will hear kind of a second intro in the middle there after the first run. So, unless I cut that out in editing, which I probably will do if I'm going to be putting them together. But, for anyone who's watched this entire thing, thank you for watching, and leave a comment if you have any feedback. Subscribe if you want to see more, and leave a like if you liked it. Thank you. See you later. Bye. By the way, this is the my normal file for kind of my off screen play. I I'm not like amazing, I am I haven't really been 
doing super hardcore try-hard builds, but... Yeah. Okay. I also haven't played a ton since the Mystic was added, or whatever her name is. The Mystic's the modern one. She's the Watcher? Yeah, the Watcher. But, yeah. If people would like to see me play some modded Play the Spire, I may have messed up some consonants there, but if anyone would like me to play some modded Slay the Spire, I certainly can, whether on this file or the other one, just let me know. But yeah, once again, until next time, take it easy.